everyone, it's Matt Master Gamer here, and welcome back to more. A Link to the Past. Yay! In the last video, we went over to the Dark Palace over here, and then we unlocked seven, uh, no, not six more dungeons, which is going to be a whole bunch of fun. But in this video, we're not actually going to go over to the next dungeon. Instead, we are going to be doing a lot and a lot and a lot of side quests. Won't oh, that just be fun? Uh, so, the first one is up here. Uh, once again, I've also been poorly and I haven't been well, sorry. And also, I've had some problem with my uh, recording thing. How I record. Had a problem with that as well. So, yeah. Which was a good. So, once again, I'm not very good at talking. Hey, wrong button. Uh, not very good at commentary again. Oh well. Uh, but don't worry, I'll get used to it. Uh, whoops, didn't mean to fall in there. I'm finally back. Sorry about that. I actually fell down twice. Ah, another skeleton stone thing. So yeah, that was annoying. Anyway, heck I was saying stuff. Uh, these are Octorox, but in the dark world, they're dark Octorox. I don't know what they're actually called, but they're dark Octorox, pretty much. <laughs> um, and this is the place I want to be. What you have to do is pick up this stone. Get up. Get up, Link. Yep. And then throw it into this circle. Then a bone fish will appear and a giant fish. Hello there, giant fish. Was it you who disturbed my peaceful nap? I will give you this if you go away. I've never heard of anyone giving me something for being annoying. Except a slap in the face. No, anyway, we've got the Quake Medallion. This is one of three medallions in the game and that we're going to get in this video. So, yay. Uh, uh. So, I'm just going to have this as, like, one recording. Even if this is, like, uh, in two videos or something. Um, I'll make this one recording. And our next place we want to go is... Oh, get harpies at where Link's house used to be. So let's go over there. Actually, before I do show you that, I first want to. Oh, uh, yeah, I know. Uh, show you. This bit here. Ah, uh oh, I'm about to die. Let's kill this thing. I don't understand its sword. It looks really weird. But so now we can hammer these pink things down so we can get through. And oh, wrong way. And it's right here. Now, the place we are right now is where Link's house used to be, but it's now a bomb shop where you can buy, well, bombs. <laughs> um, I'm not going to buy any bombs. But instead, I'm going to use the magical mirror of magical mirroriness. Go in here and get some hearts so then I stop leaping. <laughs> Right, it's already six minutes, but for you it's probably gonna be like five seconds. <laughs> Wait, I, do, I just know something weird about Link's sprite. Oh, never mind. It just there's a fly following about on my screen. <laughs> and if you use the mirror again. Go into the dark room. That's funny. The uh, the knight turned into one of those um one of these guys. That's funny. And it is left, isn't it? Yes. Whoa. Whoa. Moblins. And we're down here. And bottom left of the next screen. Whoa! Oh my goodness, it. What? Mr. Tree! Ah! That tree is alive! 
was about, to, I was about to make a portal reference, but the, the tree would have to be alive then. I was going to say the cake is alive, but that's wrong. And then go through the uh, circle of flower bushes things to go up here and get none other than a hot piece! And I do have, uh, what's it called? A script. Yes, yeah, script. And now we're going to do my favourite side quest in the game. Because you get really awesome it item and it's got a storyline to it. The first one I do is use your mirror to go back to normal world. And you've seen this guy before, how he disappears into thin air. back into the dark world and you'll see that somehow I don't know how but he is teleported into the dark world and he is a ant eater okay after wandering into this world I turned into this shape I enjoyed playing the flute in the original world there was a small grove where many animals gathered I want to see that place again I buried my flute there with some flower seeds will you try to find it for me I will. Then I will lend you my shovel. Good luck. Yay, we get a shovel. We don't have the shovel very long though, because you only borrow it. And, um, well, it's actually, I'm not sure. You could get the shovel in the game if you wanted to, or if you, or get this other item, which is way, 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 way more useful. So you just gotta dig around here. It's this flower patch, and you will find the flute, aka the ocarina. <laughs> it is the ocarina. I don't know why they call it the flute in this game. Ooh. And back into the dark room. So then we can play him the flute. We got to him first. Thank you, gamer, but it looks like I can't play my flute anymore. Please take it. If by chance you go to the village I lived in, please give it to a tired old man you will find there. Well, my mind is getting hazy. Please let me hear the sound of the flute one last time. So play the flute to him. Am I playing it? Yeah. And then he turns into a tree. How sad. I don't know why he turns into a tree. I don't know how he got into the dark world, but Apparently, he is now a tree and is now a giant. <laughs> How sad. And now we want to go over to here, which is now the village of Outcast. But we can't actually get in there because this is a black stone and we can't pick those up yet. So use your magical mirror of magical mirroriness to go into here. Go past him. And here we are back in Kakariko Village. And you want to go not here, in the milk bar. There was a tired old man in there. And as the anteater told us to, we got to give it to a tired old man. And there he is. Snores. And what you want to do is play the flute. Oh no, that's the magic. Sorry. Play the flute. Mumble, mumble. Oh, this is my son's flute. Did you see? Meet my son? Where is he? Is he alright? Oh, I see. Well, I can tell what you want to say by the look in your eyes. Would you keep the flute? And will you play its sweet melody to the bird in front of Village Square? I beg of you, please. My son would probably want it this way. But still, I wish I could see him once more. Ah, his son is dead, so he can't. Ooh hoo, ooh hoo. And go to the top of the village and play the song. Where now, all of a sudden, randomly. So I can't actually hear the music, so I'm like waiting for it to happen, but it doesn't. 
And there we go! The uh, wooden bird transforms into an actual bird! Amazing. And with this bird, we can now travel to different areas, as I'll show you right now. Birdie. There we go. And we want to go to number two. Why do we want to go to number two, where the witch is? Well, we want to buy a green potion first. Yes, I do have an empty bottle. Uh, buy a green potion. That's okay. And we're not actually going to use the green potion just yet. I just wanted to get it. Because uh, I was about to go ahead of myself. But I don't want to go ahead of myself. So... We want to go back to number three. Which is right outside the pedestal. What are you going to say for yourself? Well, oh, you're still sold out. Now I'm stuck. Uh, now we go... Oh, I remember. Uh, now we have the hammer. We can break this... Break this, um... Uh, stamp, which will now let us go to the portal. Just that side. Rico Village. Hey! There's a pathway that you can get to, but you can't yet, because um, there's another red stone in the way, but yeah. Ugh, chair. And now, go through here, and here. Also, the forest, well no, we already know that the forest is all happy now, because after we got the Master Sword. Now, get out your hammer. And... Whoa! Double rainbow all the way! And a... Skull Coco? I've seen many weird things, but that is the weirdest. Ah! The bomb just killed that moblin. What are you gonna say, Mr. Tree? Quit bothering me and watch where you're going when you dash around. Hey, I meant to talk to the other one, but I forgot. So yeah. The, apparently some of the trees can talk. Good for them. <laughs> and now what am I doing in this place? I am going to go and... Ah, be careful of the thieves. They're mice, apparently. I want to go down this way. Use your magical mirror of magical mirroriness. Hello, and look, a normal cuckoo. Uh, sorry if also if my voice seems a bit weird. That's because my voice is a bit weird. Uh, my voice is actually starting to break. Dun dun dun! So if it ever does, don't make fun of me. <laughs> and there's this weird pedestal thing here. I don't, I'm not exactly sure what it is, but what you have to do is sprinkle some magic powder on it, and then a bat will appear! Ah! What will you do, Mr. Bat? Hey, blast you for waking me from my deep, dark sleep. I mean, thanks a lot, sir. But now, I will get my revenge on you. Get ready for it, uh, if that's okay with you, sir. And he will electrocute us. And give us... Ha ha ha! I laugh at your misfortune. Now your magic meter will drop by one half. Congratulations! Now do your best, even though I'm sure it won't be enough. Have a nice day. See you. So that means now, every time we use something, um, however, how much magic it used to do is now dropped by half. So it's pretty much like a, a longer magic meter, but they didn't want to make it longer because that would ex um, make this it would cover up too much of the screen. <laughs> And now the next place we want to go to. I'm actually doing this out of order. So yeah, I'm getting a bit mixed up. Next place we want to go to is the... What? Okay, let's go this way. And now I'm alive. I got stuck inside the black rock. And hey, that tree is also alive, isn't it? 
Is that tree alive? Yeah, it is. His eyes are moving. And... Actually, before I go to the graveyard, I'm going to go play a mini game. Why will this? Why does this thing keep following me? And we're gonna go into here. Talk to this mouse. Hi, may I help you? You can open two chests for thirty rubies. Why not? Why don't you play? Okay, so I shall play. I shall try and find a heart piece that will fail. And every time uh, there is a heart piece, there's also a lot of rubies. So if you do start running out of more rubies, hopefully you will get a ruby. More rubies from it. Oh yes, you can rubies. Nope. I'm gonna cut cut this out until I get the heart piece. Actually, no. I will end the episode here. No, 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 no. no. I will get the I'll get the heart piece and then I'll uh, end the episode. Oh, I didn't pay. Okay. Oh, <laughs> I got the heart piece. Yay! <laughs> Lol. Anyway, thank you for watching this video of A Link to the Past. Uh, I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next video where we will do even more side quests and hopefully enter the, um, to the next dungeon. See you guys then.